Hello everyone, we are from True Maths and in this video we are going to solve question number 9th of exercise 13.1 and the question says a wooden article was made by scooping out a hemisphere from each end of a solid cylinder. If the height of the cylinder is 10 cm and its base is of radius 3.5 cm, you have to find the total surface area of this article. Now first of all let's imagine how this article will look when two hemispheres are scooped out scooped out from a solid cylinder. So from this end this is this hemisphere is taken out and similarly from this end also, this hemisphere, hemisphere part is taken out. These both are same hemispheres. Okay. Now, you have to find the total surface area of this article. As I have already discussed, if you want to find the total surface area of this, you need to find the area of that surface which is visible to you. Now, how many surfaces are visible to me? If I look at this, the curved surface area of this cylinder will be visible to me. This complete because uh, this is inside this cylinder. But the curved surface will, uh, will enact in, as same and the curved surface area of the cylinder will be visible to me. If I see from the top, this curved surface area of this, cylinder, uh, this hemisphere will be visible to me. This one. Similarly, from the bottom again if I see this curved surface area of this cylinder will be visible to me. Now if you have to find out the total surface area of this article will be equals to the curved surface area of the cylinder plus <coughs> these are two curved surface area of hemisphere and if I join these two hemisphere, this will form a complete sphere. So that will be the surface area of sphere. Because both are same. If I take this out and if I place this on the top of this, this will form a complete sphere. So now what are the formulas to find out the surface area of the cylinder? That is 2 pi r h plus the surface area of the Square is 4 pi r square. We already know these formulas. Now we have to solve this. First of all, take 2 pi r as common. That will make your calculation a bit easy. And from this expression, 2 pi r is taken out. Only h will remain inside the bracket. And from this, from 4 can be written as 2 multiplied by 2. And from 2 multiplied by 2, 2 is taken out. So only 2 will remain pi is taken out and from 2r, 1r is taken out. So only 1r will remain inside the bracket. Now you can solve this to the value of pi is 22 by 7. Radius here is given to you as 3.5 centimeter. So this is 3.5 and if I remove the decimal, I can write it as 35 upon 10. Height is given to you as the height of the cylinder is 10 centimeter. So the height is given to you as 10 centimeter. This complete height is given to you as 10 centimeter and the radius is 3.5 centimeters. And this is 2 multiplied by 3.5. Now this can be cancelled 5 times, 5, 7, uh, 35. This can be cancelled 2 times and 2 can be cancelled with 2. So this will be 22 is multiplied by this is 10 plus 3.5 multiplied by 2 is 3.5 multiplied by 2 is 7. And this is 22 is multiplied by 10 plus 7 is 17. So if I multiply these two numbers, I will get my answer. So the 22 is multiplied by 17. So this is 54. This is 22, 4, 7, 3. So the answer will be 3, 74 centimeter square because this is an area so the SI unit will be in centimeter square. So this is how you can solve this last question of this exercise. 
I hope you have understood how to solve this question. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel. And if you have any problem in maths, you can directly contact us. The phone number, the email address and the WhatsApp number is given below in the description. Thank you.